السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته Hello everyone and welcome to this new video lesson Today we are starting a new unit which is unit 7 under the topic of the arts Our session today is mainly a vocabulary session in which we are going to discover, explore and practice using a group of words related to the theme of arts Let us get started. First of all, I would like to ask you about these people. Do you know them? Of course you do. The first is the Moroccan famous comedian Hassan Fid. The second is a drawing of the famous Spanish painter Pablo Picasso. The third is Charlie Chaplin's famous character Charlo. And the last is the famous singer Meherzin. The question is, what are they? They are artists. Artists. What does that mean? It means they do arts. But do they do the same type of art? Of course, no. And that means there are many types of arts. Let's get discover them. In general, there are many different forms of arts. There are performing arts, in which artists usually use their body or voice to express themselves. There are also visual arts, in which artists create something you can see, such as paintings, drawings, films, photos, etc. And there are also written arts in which artists can create something through writing. Let us now give examples of each of the three forms of arts and let us start with performing arts. These are arts like music, theater, dance, Mime, which means expressing yourself with body gestures without talking. Opera and magic. As we have seen in these examples, artists use their body or their voice like in singing or opera to express themselves. That's why we call them performing arts. Visual arts are arts like painting, cinema or filmmaking. Drawing, drawing, sculpture, sculpture, and this means making or creating something artistic from some kind of material like wood, rocks, another example is photography. One more example is poetry. As we have seen, writing can also be an art. But writing what exactly? An example is writing novels and stories. 
script writing. And by the way, the script is the written text of a film, uh, a play, etc. Another example is writing poetry and poems or writing comics, funny short stories. Let us now practice using more words related to the theme of arts. In this exercise, I would like you to put the following words in the appropriate column. You can see three columns, so I would like you to classify the words into those related to painting, those related to music, and finally those related to cinema. Try to stop the video, think of the exercise, answer, we shall correct in a few moments. Let us correct the task now. The first word is acting. It means performing on stage, in a movie or in a play, for example. So the word is related to cinema. The second word is portrait. This is a picture usually representing the face of a person. The word is related to painting. The next word is pianist, someone who plays the piano, so definitely related to music. Actor, someone who acts in a movie or a play, so definitely related to the cinema. The next word is concert, a music concert, for example, usually uh, when a singer sings in public, so definitely related to music. Director, or talking about a person who directs movie. In Morocco, of examples like Dris Rouh, Kamel Kamel, Jamal Bin Mjdoub, and international directors can be uh, Steven Spielberg, James Cameron, etc. So we're talking about a word related to cinema. Performance to perform, to do something, to act on stage. The word can be used in the domain of cinema and also music. The next word is film industry, which refers to companies, institutions, studios and people who are involved in filmmaking and film production. So we're talking about a word related to the cinema. Comedy is a style of movies, so definitely related to the cinema as well. Songwriter, song, from the verb to sing. So this would give you the right answer, matching the word with music. Picture. Say a photo or a picture. The word is related to painting. Just like drawing. Orchestra. Orchestra. The word refers to a group of musicians uh, that make music together. So, the word is related to music. The next word is composer. This is someone who writes music, produces music. So 
we're talking about words related to music. Painter. The word is definitely related to painting. And finally, landscapes. These are pictures that represent a view of the nature. And the word is related to painting. That's everything for today. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good day and stay safe.